Yozora. All right, so we on a new segment, Talk of the Town. Today we got a special guest, Danny Hunnitz. Ooh, your mama. So people want to know why Hunnitz and not millions. Um, because you know, Hunnitz is Hunnitz is part of my culture, like you know, but it could be hundred million. So it's like either way, the Hunnitz will always be there, like you know, like either way, it's money. Yeah, right. You know, Hunnitz gonna get to the millions and then become hundred millions. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, for people that don't know, where you from? I'm from motherfucking Kenosha. You get me? But was also raised in Brownsville. So, okay. you know? So, how did your rap name come about? Um, well, I watched a lot of mob movies and stuff. And, mm -hmm. my, you know, my middle name is Daniel's son. So, Danny come from that. And like I said, you know, Hunnis is the culture, so I had to put the Hunnis behind it, you know? Why we the camera like that? <laughs> you know. <laughs> so when did music come, or when did you find a love for music, or? Um, after poetry, you know, me and my friends. So you used to write poems? Yes. I used to get in trouble, and my mom used quick to make. Load. Nah, I can't do it. Uh-uh. I'm washed. <laughs> I might say some Damn. dumb shit, but Moses I used to get in trouble. Lots of blue type shit. Yeah, nah, way beyond that. Like oh, I used you to was have getting to, deep. Yeah, I used to have to make poems, to write poems to make sense and really like it's crazy. Don't get in trouble, kids. Okay. <laughs> so, so from poetry to music, how did the music? Um. Well, so yeah, so you know, I started off with poetry. Um, but you got the rap upon? Yeah, like, like it? it was like, you know, like, I don't know, always flow with it and stuff. It was just like the flow of poetry. So, like, one day, freestyle with my friends. It's like, oh, shit, you can really do this. I'm like, word? Like, yeah, let's try it. So what was your first song you ever made? Um, My first song I ever made was a Earl Sweatshirt remix. Don't ask. Are you in tour? Uh, <laughs> don't okay. ask. Please don't ask. But yeah, that was. It's on SoundCloud, I think, under the alias. Still? I think so, under the alias. Oh, shit. Y'all gotta um, check that out, y'all. He's giving a job. I think Tay Hancho or something. Yeah. So yeah, a fake name on it? Uh, oh, that was you back yeah, in the day. Yeah, that was one of my aliases from wow. back then. I'm dead. So how do you feel like you improved mu musically from then to now? Um. Well, a lot. Well, Where flow. Flow sound. Yeah, the flow, the sound. I have better character. I found Literally. myself, like, before it was freestyling. Like, you know, you could tell I was, like, still trying to figure things out and stuff. Now, you know, even though I be in the boot and mess up, like, a thousand times. But, you know, I, you know, I got my flow and my style, and I fucked that shit up. And I'll bust a mean freestyle, so don't fuck around. So you bust a mean freestyle? I bust a mean So we gonna see you do some freestyles 2021? Oh uh, man, yeah, yeah, a couple of, couple of. Okay, okay. So what are some artists you was listening to early on? We know Earl Sweatshirt. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, <laughs> Earl Sweatshirt, um, ASAP Rocky was fucking awesome. Um, Tyler the Creator, Frank Ocean. Um, that's the creative stuff. So the, how, I was say so. The hood stuff. The hood stuff, you know, the Cassidy, the Jay Z, the DMXs. Um, Yo, nobody said Cassidy in a really long time. Yeah, I, I, I fucking what? I used to be obsessed with Cassidy music, like the problem versus the hustler, you know, like. But yeah, um, Jay Z, Biggie, Nas, all those type people. Yeah. So, um, how did you? I want to say develop your sound. What kind of sound would you say you make? I don't think it's really drill, but I don't mm. think it's. Not not drill. I don't know. Uh, it's like a, it's like it's like it's what like a mixture. Music? I call it what the fuck, but I feel like like you know, I, it's a mixture. I could give you pop. I could give you I could give you rap. I could give you rock and roll. It don't matter. Like it's everything in one. So it's called what the fuck. Yep. What the fuck. Uh, I think we should change that. Now. I'm crying. Wow. You... But you can do a little bit of everything. So what's your save to do? 
like favorite hobby favorite genre oh my favorite genre is rap i love rap and stuff i'm saying you just said you could do a little bit of everything yeah right? that's favorite? my favorite one to do out of everything though. everything like, yeah that's right but i can do a little bit of everything okay you know okay. i said right. it right okay okay <laughs> So, mm-hmm. what inspired the song Too Sturdy? Oh God! What? What? Do you feel like you're too sturdy? Like what? What inspired that? TikTok. TikTok. Yeah, Jersey, New York. They always want to know who the sturdy is and stuff like that. So I do, you know, tell Jersey like, yeah, we're sturdy, you know, because you know Jersey they got that little weird dances, and then, <laughs> you know. You go on TikTok right now, they always saying who's sturdy and stuff like that, yeah. So you're going to start busting dance moves or nah? Yeah, I, you I, do I, be, I, I, I yeah, like, you, you know, do. you know, you know. I be on... Shout Jersey, man. Shout New York, you know. Shout all the state. So in your previous interview with the other side, mm, you was like... Oh, God. Why is it? Oh, God. It's yeah, nothing it's bad. Rubber part. You was telling, you know, how the whole dancing came about and things like that. Mm -hmm. It was like, yo, shout out to Siggy because he started that whole, well, the tool, whatever, whatever. Shout out. Shout out. It was fake, a shout out. Shout out. Is that? Hell no. I just stated a fact. That was it. It was no shout out. Damn, I was like, maybe a collab coming one day? Nah. (laughs) What? I ain't going to hold you. He do got like a one, two tracks that I definitely be like, yo, son, this shit is like outrageous. But yeah, never, never. Oh, okay, wow. But he's fucking hot. I would not take that from him. Okay, but you just good? Yeah, I'm good on my phone. Okay, all right, wow. <laughs> okay, so what's your favorite song that you released so far? Uh, that would have to be Shake It Baby because I had the most fun with that. So. Let's get into Shake It Baby, so million streams mm-hmm. almost a million views mm-hmm. how do how you feel like how that song rollout was um how you feel about the turnout the turnout could have been 10 times better like you know that's 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 it but um other than that that was it was fucking awesome a great experience you know kicked open the door for me and stuff for a lot of places you know got me stamped, you know, and everything like that. Like, Shake, shake It Baby was a change. It was a change, in fact, of my life and stuff like that. Okay. Made your boy, you know, from a, a tier three player to, you know, tier one. Like, ah, right, yeah, that boy could be an all-star, like, you know. Okay, Um, a lot of people say that you slept on. What do you have to say about that? Uh, I gotta wake the people up soon. Mm-hmm. I, gotta, I gotta wake that. So I, you agree? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, Why do you feel like you slept on though? Um, I gotta be more consistent. The people, the people see me. The people mm-hmm. know I'm there. The people know I got it. You know that that's that. But I just gotta be more consistent and stuff like that. I gotta generate. I gotta keep the people because the people will look, but the people will turn their head like this. You know. Mm-hmm. So it's like you know, I gotta make. I gotta keep the people towards me. Watch me, people. I'm hot. <laughs> so keep those eyes on you. Mm-hmm. Okay, so the song called Lisa. Mm. Why'd you call it that? Um, like I said, you know, I'm I'm big on mob movies and stuff like that. So like us, I felt like that was like a mob name, like you know, like a mobster wife or something. But like, yeah, if you understand what I'm talking about, and Lisa and the song Lisa and everything, you know, I just felt like it just need to be named Lisa. Like, you know. <laughs> So, what's your process like in a studio session? How oh, do you come up with these concepts? And oh man, let like my let my team fun. tell it. You know, yes, we have absolutely nothing but fun. Um, I gotta try that shit a thousand times before we get it right and stuff. Oh, man. Well, y'all be too turnt? Like what? Nah, yeah, that too and stuff. <laughs> you know, but like you know, I be wanting everything perfect on top of that. Plus, I just be messing up. Cause it, it, know be natural with it like so it's like you know like all so my you, songs is natural like this is okay. me so you don't write oh i write hell yeah okay. but i still mess up okay yeah 
So it's okay for artists to mess up. Oh hell yeah! If you want the the, the best one, you want the best. You want that song, you know, you you know, you gonna mess up. You know, yo, start that over, do that over. Let me, you know. So you definitely in tune to like what the engineer be doing, like yo. Yes, yes. Shout out everybody who ever recorded me, but my main, you know. Craig the engineer and Rich right now. Rich working with me and stuff. Rich doing this thing and stuff. We've been locking in the studio and stuff. Okay. A lot of people should work with him. So it's a lot of artists come from Canarsie. Yes. Do you feel like Canarsie is on the run right now? Canarsie is the new Atlanta. <laughs> like all the way straight? Canarsie is the new Atlanta. So y'all support each other like Elena and all what? that? We got no choice. The eldest, you know, whether we like each other or not, the eldest is... Is is once once this shit busts, it's like listen guys, get your head out your asses. You know? Kanasi's the new Atlanta. Yes, Kanasi's the new Atlanta. I said it first, people. Okay, so do you have any future collabs on the way? Um, yes, I have collabs with like the battle rapper Cortez. Okay. You know? Yeah, I, I'm in so. Yes, uh-huh. I have um Tay Floss. Okay. <laughs> I got Quelly Wu, mm -hmm. T Da Wu Slide, you know. Um, me and, and T Da Wu is mm -hmm. I'm like, what you me, me, me and um, Eli Frost is talking to get um, him on a remix of Damn. Shh. He liked that song a lot. After you told us. Okay. Mm -hmm. hey, exclusive, the exclusive. He liked that song a lot and everything. But um, yeah, I got a couple, yeah, a couple artists. Um, I'm usually by myself I make a lot of songs by myself and stuff but yeah mm -hmm. that's that's a few names to name I can't name everybody right now that's cool so what does woo your mama mean what does that mean woo your mama like that's that's you know like there, there's there's I can't say there's woo then there's woo your mama because you know it's the same thing but like woo your mama is like a super saiyan mode of woo like you, I feel good like you know I just make ten thousand dollars like I got ten you know, like, so like I just chain. make twenty. I just make the boy mom, like, <laughs> like, like, you know, like that's a hallelujah for a woo nigga, like, you feel me? That's a hallelujah for a woo nigga, boy mom. Okay. <laughs> Yo, you so animated. Yeah, I'm son. just saying, people. <laughs> so is that just a slogan? That's that's it's that's just a phrase. that's that's is whatever it a label? Like, that's what that's it? whatever you want it to be. Like as long as you know it's mine, so don't steal my shit. I will shoot this shit out you. But that's 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 so everything. You got that copyright and all that. Yeah, you know, like, yeah, that's my shit. Like that's, that's me. Like, that's that's the we mama Nina. I've been two seated with sibling and put two leaders. You get me? That's the full thing. But who your mama? You know, the who your mama is just like that's you in a great spirit. Like nothing can take you down. Like. Top of the world. Okay. Mm -hmm. So how did you, how do you go about picking your beats? Oh God, man. You uh, got producers or? Yes, I have personal producers and management. Like we, we sit down, you know, I nag, I cry, I scratch. I want this beat. You know, sometimes they're, no, this beat. You know? So they're definitely very much in tune with the beats you select? Yes, everything, everything. Okay. What, what drops next, like what's hot, what to say on the damn beat, where we gonna go with the beat, we gotta, we gotta build it, like, you know? But yes, okay. shout out to everybody who, you know, all my producers, shout out to LS, shout out to Z1K who sparked it, you feel me? Shout out to my boy, once again, Richwell, shout out to Benji Roy, shout out to Boris, you know? So, yeah. All right, so in the song, Damn, you said, the label say I'm next. Well, you're next. So, how, what, like, so what's going on? Um, yeah, you know, I got some calls. I still, I still get calls, still keep in contact with certain people and shit like that. And Do you want to sign a label? Do you want to be independent? I want to like own everything. I want to, I want to have me. I got a family to feed, like, you know, like, I want to show them, like. You could feed your family and still be signed. Yeah, you could, but, like, <laughs> I, I, I want to have, like, that Michael Jackson career without the, the, the hassle of the labels and shit, you know? Mm. I want to be the greatest of all time and like really own my masters. Oh, um, damn. Also, when you song damn, you was being spicy. You was talking about how, so like people copying your wave. Oh shit. So, how you feel about that? I mean, you know, like, my work speaks for itself. So Just like look people, at the work. 
Who are copying you with? Yeah, we got the work, check the dates, you know. Check the dates? Check the dates. Nobody specific, just whoever it fits for? Yeah, you know, you can check niggas' catalogs, you know. Do you, you know? Niggas can search up who they want to search up, you know. Check niggas' catalogs, see how they was rapping before, you know. Certain shit came out and then see how they was rapping after, you know. That's just that, you know. So how you feel about that? A motherfucker's godfather. <laughs> you the godfather of shit? Motherfucking godfather. Okay, so what's next for you 2021? Halfway shit. Through the year? Hits. I got some hits in the making, man. And I got some hits in the cut. Got some hits in the making. Got some great collabs. Um, shit. I done did everything but fucking shoot a movie or man, be in a movie and shit. That's next, you know. Maybe. Yeah. Movie? Mm-hmm. Movies? Mm-hmm. So tell the people where to find you and where to find your music and what's out and all that good stuff. Well, here comes the cocky part, people. <laughs> you can actually Google me. You know, Danny Hundreds. Everything pops up. Boom. I don't want to be like, yo, you got to go on Instagram, man. You no. Know, Google me, motherfucker. Everything pops up right there. Blah. Go Google Ben. Everything. You spot everything. Everything you need. My whole fucking... Bio everything, you know? Google, Danny Hundreds.